This special feature is produced by Democracy at Work for Workers Independent News. This is Richard Wolff for Democracy at Work. I want to tell a story that is about America today, but it's not about workers in factories or offices or stores. It's about farmers. They're workers too. And their news is important for us and never, never more than at this moment. I want to tell you the story about Rick Friday. He is a cartoonist. He makes cartoons for the Farm News, a uh, news service that goes to many, many farmers in the state of Iowa. Very famous there. He's been a cartoonist for that service, for that newspaper, uh, for 21 years. He started in 1995. He's very well liked, very well admired, really a fixture for Iowa farmers. Well, on the 29th of April, the paper published a cartoon that he had made, and I'm going to tell you what the cartoon said and then tell you what happened to Mr. Friday. But maybe to whet your appetite, I'll tell you he got fired. Here's what his cartoon. It shows two farmers in overalls wearing baseball caps chatting at a fence. The first one says, quote, I wish there was more profit in farming, end quote. The other one replies, there is. In the year 2015, the CEOs of Monsanto, DuPont Pioneer, and John Deere Tractor combined to make more money than 2,129 Iowa farmers. Somebody complained to the management, and the next day, Rick Friday was fired after 21 years. It seems that in Iowa, as in so much of the United States, if you say the truth, if you say what everybody who's paying attention knows is the truth, you have violated some unspoken rule that we're supposed to pretend an economy and a society falling apart because of the gap between rich and poor is actually not doing anything of the sort. This is Richard Wolff for Democracy at Work in a special feature for Workers Independent News.